Hello, guys. Welcome again to the next one. Number nine. Who is my number nine favorite wrestler? I'm about to tell you right now. And as you can see, it's The Rock against Kurt Angle in a, I guess, a regular match. I'm not, was it a regular match? I'm not sure. But it's The Rock and Kurt Angle. My favorite, number nine, is the Olympic gold medalist, Kurt Angle. He is my ninth favorite wrestler of all time. Uh, this goes all the way back to his, um, his days in the WWE when he had hair. <laughs> I remember those days. The guy is a funny, a funny guy from what he did in WWE with the little promo with Brock Lesnar. Uh, but how just the stuff he's done, you know? He's I I found him funny. I found him cool. Uh, Kurt Angle, and he's one of my favorite guys in the ring to watch. You know, and I'm not a big fan of that kind of wrestling for some reason. I'm just I don't know. It's not as fun. But this guy, you know, this guy is good. And the main reason I watched TNA or ever I heard about TNA was because of this guy. When he went to G TNA, that's when I gained interest in TNA. And I've enjoyed seeing him there, you know, but I would love to see him come back to WWE. And, uh, but I don't think that will happen for a while because he seems to be very happy with TNA. But, you know, it would be cool to see him with WWE one last run. But it's Kurt Angle, you know. It's, you never know what's going to happen. But Kurt Angle is my ninth favorite wrestler. And I love the feud he with The Rock, even though I was always rooting for The Rock. And then when he betrayed the Alliance uh, in the Invasion storyline... I didn't know anything about you know. I was like, I never read spoilers or anything, so I would be surprised by it. I was like, holy crap! I was just so happy WWE, the WWF got to say, and WCW went away, the Alliance went away, but it was cool. Didn't you think it was cool? Kurt Angle was backstabbing, you know. I didn't see that one coming. <laughs> I didn't see that one coming, but it was beautiful. It was pretty cool, and. You know, I've been a fan of Krangle. That's that's all I gotta say. The Rock is one of my other favorite wrestlers. I won't tell you what number he is because he'll be back soon. This is the only video you'll see Kurt Angle in because he's number nine. But you'll see Kurt. Yeah, I'll tell you a lot about why I like Kurt Angle. The reason I'm doing these things like this, like you know, I'm doing one guy. The lose is pretty much Kurt Angle. This is the only video Kurt Angle is gonna be. The only reason I'm doing these like this. I'm not going to explain both reasons why I like the guys like this. Like, you know, why The Rock would be my one of my favorites. You know, and then Kurt Angle is another reason. No, I want to just do a separate video for each one of my favorites. I'm counting it down pretty much of why they're my favorite guys. And I'm putting them pretty much in matches. And, you know, that's why you'll see certain guys against certain guys. But number nine. I just rambled about nothing. Number nine, Kurt Angle. The first time... I, you know, I, I, I don't know, wait, I remember the Royal Rumble, I think it was the one in New York, the one where Taz made his debut, and I think Kurt Angle got choked out, like, in a couple of seconds, I don't, I'm not very sure, my memory's a little fuzzy, but I remember that one, I remember when he, I, was it three times, or, I think it was three times in the King of the Ring pay-per-view, when he threw Shane McMahon at, at the, at the thing over there, the, I can't, I don't know what it's called, but you know what I'm trying to say. He threw him like three times, and that thing was crazy. This, and, you know, I've always, this guy, he's always had good matches. It's hard to find a match where he was really, well, no, it's not hard to find a match that where he really sucked. But it's, you know, a match where he was outshining, this guy could outshine a lot of people. He's a good wrestler. And his feet with the rock is pretty cool. I remember there was something about a book. And I think uh, he wrote about the times he beat The Rock. And The Rock tells him, what about the time I beat you? This, 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 and he's like, no, I didn't think I mentioned it. And then I remember the time about he likes jugs, big, ju big huge jugs or something, the milk. <laughs> him and The Rock were in the back. I found that one funny. Very funny, very funny. <laughs> I found those very funny, those things very funny, and, you know, fuck, I'm sorry, I was, I'm, like, hiding right here in Modern Warfare 3 right now, I'm not playing right now, I'm just commentating right now, but I found Kurt Angle funny, I think that's why I like him, because I found him as a funny guy, you know, and very, and he's very serious in the ring, and he's pretty good in the ring, um, I'm not, a, I wasn't really a fan of him and Brock, but, well, I guess those were pretty good match. they were good matches, but I wasn't a big fan of that, but I was a fan of their stuff in the back, that was funny, some funny stuff, you know. I'm, I enjoy that. I don't know. I've just, 
I like Kurt Angle for a long time. He's a good guy. And then when he went to TNA, uh, you know, he he he, he made me interested in TNA and. I didn't know a whole bunch of things about wrestling at the time, but then, you know, just because of that, I've learned so much. And, you know, that's, I think Kurt Angle is just one of my favorites. Just because I, you know, he's a great wrestler. And he's funny. He can be funny at times, but he could also be serious. He's got a lot. He's, he's very, I don't know the word for it, but he's very good. He's a good wrestler. Yes. There's just some aspects he's missing that's not my favorites. But. He's one of my favorites. I'll give you that. One of my nine favorites. It looks always changing for some reason, but if you guys do, tuned around, tuned around, is that how the kids are saying it now? I don't know. Uh, either way, that I think that was a nice finish right there. You know, he countered the Olympic slam and rock bottom. I think that was a nice finish, in my opinion. But anyway, if you uh, stayed for the whole video, I like to thank you. Um, you know, leave a leave a comment. Don't be shy. Uh, I would love to hear feedback. And thank you guys. For watching the video uh please comment please like uh if you guys want to subscribe to my channel go ahead i'm not i'm not opposed to you i'll probably sub back to your channel if you subscribe to my channel so i'll see you guys around and uh have a nice day